Dozens of officers have swarmed a neighborhood in New Berlin. A video just into our newsroom from News Chopper 12 shows officers hey, leading I, someone I out of a them. wooded area and placing them into a police car. They had been searching the area near Moreland and Beloit Roads. Interstate 894 is also closed at Oklahoma Avenue for a shots fired investigation. We don't know if it's related to the shooting at Mayfair. So let's get right to Matt Salemi and News Chopper 12 above the scene in New Berlin. Matt. Yeah, the New Berlin PD set out a alert at about 9.07 saying that there was searching for a, a subjects that were in, involved in a pursuit from Milwaukee County. It led them to the, this wooded area here that is uh, between uh, West Armor Avenue and uh, 2609 South Moreland Road. And now you can see there's still officers in the woods. Every once in a while, their flashlights pop on. I think they might still be looking for someone at this point. But as you saw just a few moments ago, we were looking through the darkness and the flashlights came on and I could see a dog snarling and I could see them uh, have somebody by their arms above their head. They dragged that person yeah, out of the wooded area they, here and then put them in a Milwaukee County Sheriff's squad. And now they're back in the uh, wooded area. More officers, and you can see they, from time to time, they'll all turn their lights on, then they turn them all off again. Like they're still searching for something. So I'll continue to monitor the situation down here. But again, the, it seemed like right after they gave the all clear at Mayfair that we had a ton more cops come down this way and join this search as well. All right, Matt Salemi reporting in News Chopper 12. Thank you, Matt. And 12 News' Derek Rose is live at the scene. He, he joins us now. Derek? Yeah, and Joyce, we were at Mayfair Mall when we saw uh, half a dozen or so law enforcement officers go from there, uh, presumably in this direction. We are along May, uh, Moreland Road. We're going to come down this hill here just a second. Over across the street is where we had uh, a lot of uh, uh, police officers that had their lights on earlier this evening. Uh, they have since turned their lights off. They have been pointed in the direction of these woods. And we're going to come down this hill just a little bit. If you could look straight through um, the wooded area, that is the uh, residential area that Matt Salemi was referring to at Scott and Armour. Uh, that area and this area where we are are separated by these woods. We have seen police using drones in the air as well to continue this search on our way here. We were passed by several uh, law enforcement officers, lights and sirens going. So unfortunately, a very uh, busy and active day for law enforcement. Uh, we did check some of the radio transmissions earlier today to get an idea of how some of this started. Here's what we found. On a blue Nissan Altima. It just fired several shots at my squad. And you can hear that is a, a, a law enforcement uh, officer saying that someone fired shots at his squad. We are unclear. As you can see, uh, a Milwaukee County Sheriff's officer, uh, Sheriff's deputy rather, going down Moreland here. Very busy. Unclear at this point if that officer was in fact hit or if any officers were injured in that shooting. Police have yet to give a briefing on this situation here in New Berlin, but we are standing by and keeping our eyes on this situation here on the ground as Matt Salemi is in the sky. Joyce.